Hi, I'm Valerie, and today I'm going to share with you how to make a Bill's World Famous Lemonade. People that buy our lemonade year after year always come back and claim that we have the best lemonade they ever tasted. It was a special recipe of a man from Central Illinois. From the start, he used a unique process which he perfected and with his handmade touch, he created the best fresh lemonade. It's so much fun selling a product that you know is good and that customers tell you over and over it's the best they ever tasted. You will experience this kind of reaction as your customers learn what you have to offer them. I'd like to introduce the two pieces of equipment we'll use to make a Bill's world famous lemonade. This is a Sunkist sectionizer and this is a crusher. Now, the sectionizer has a sharp blade in here. The purpose is to slice lemons quickly. So always exercise caution when using this piece of equipment. The crusher is 39 pounds of stainless steel. The purpose is to mix the lemons and the sugar blend together to make a lemonade base. This piece of equipment comes with a one year warranty and is built for high volume production. Now, both of these pieces of equipment are completely mobile. They use no electricity. Now, I'm going to walk through the entire process. First, get a sun-kissed lemon from the storage bin. Then, raise the sectionizer lever and place the whole lemon vertically into the cutting area. Hold a 32 ounce cup underneath the sectionizer with your left hand. With your right hand, pull the sectionizer handle down, cutting the lemon into eight slices. And the lemon will drop into the cup. Next, one scoop of Bill's Sugar Blend. Empty the scoop on top of the sliced lemon. Then, raise the crusher handle to the highest position and insert your cup underneath the press shaft. Press the crusher handle down. Rotate the cup in clockwise motion while crushing the lemon and sugar blend together to create a paste syrup. Repeat this crushing motion about eight times. This should require a minimum effort. Then remove the cup from the crusher and you have your lemonade base. At this point, the base is ready to place in the holding area or you can continue to make a lemonade. Upon a customer order, scoop a full cup of ice and fill the 32 ounce cup to the top with ice. Then fill the cup with purified water just to the mark below the brim. Next, place the shaker lid securely over the top of the serving cup. At this point, hold the cup and lid together with one hand and place the other one on the bottom of the cup. Turn it upside down and shake, spread that lemon mixture throughout the entire cup. When you're done, turn it over. Now I'm going to repeat that entire process one more time, this time a bit faster. The whole thing can happen in front of your customer's eyes. First, get a sun-kissed lemon. Then, raise the sectionizer lever and place the whole lemon vertically into the cutting area. Hold a 32 ounce cup underneath the sectionizer with your left hand. And with your right hand, pull the sectionizer handle down, cutting the lemon into eight slices, and the lemon will drop into the cup. Next, select one scoop of Bill's Sugar Blend. Empty the scoop on top of the sliced lemon. Then, lift the crusher handle to the highest position and insert your cup. Press the crusher handle down. Rotate the cup in a clockwise motion while crushing the lemon and sugar blend together. This creates a paste syrup. Always repeat this motion about eight times, which should require a minimum of effort. Then. Remove the cup from the crusher. At this point, you could place it in the holding area or continue to make a lemonade. Upon a customer order, scoop a full cup of ice and fill the 32 ounce cup to the very top with ice. Then fill the cup with purified water to the mark below the brim. Place a shaker lid securely over the top of the serving cup and hold both the cup and the lid together with one hand and place the other one on the bottom of the cup. 
Turn it upside down and shake, spreading that lemon mixture throughout your cup. And when you're done, turn it back over. Now this time through the process, I'm gonna give you some tips to help make everything run smoothly. Select a sun-kissed lemon from the storage bin. Then raise the sectionizer handle and place the whole lemon vertically into the cutting area. But always be careful because the blade is just under the surface. Then hold the 32 ounce cup underneath the sectionizer. This is my first tip. Always hold the cup up to the bottom of the sectionizer with your left hand. Don't set the cup down. This prevents spills when the lemon falls and also protects your hand from accidentally being sliced. Pull the sectionizer handle down, cutting the lemon into eight slices. My second tip, just be gentle. A smooth, strong motion will cut the lemon. Don't slam the handle down. This equipment is durable and will last through heavy business, but be careful not to be rough. Next, select one scoop of Bill's Sugar Blend. Empty the scoop on top of the sliced lemon. Then lift the crusher handle and slide your 32 ounce cup onto the main shaft. Now this is my third tip. When you press the crusher handle down the first time, go a little bit slow. The lemon juice can squirt, but after the first crush, the process can go quickly. Rotate that serving cup in a clockwise motion while crushing the lemon and sugar blend together. Always crush eight times, creating a paste syrup. And remember, Always add that sugar blend to the cup before crushing so it can soak into the lemon. Remove the cup from the crusher. Either store the cup in the holding area or continue to make your lemonade. The next step is to scoop a full cup of ice and fill the 32 ounce serving cup to the very top. Another tip, always fill the cup completely to the top with ice so you can see it above the brim. You'll find when you shake the ice and water together, it speeds up the melting process. So always make sure you fill the glass with plenty of ice and make sure each customer has an ice cold drink. And another tip, sometimes customers will ask for theirs to be made with little ice or no ice and always ask your manager how to handle this. But I recommend saying, it's hard to make this drink with little ice because we have a recipe. See, less ice means more water and all the ingredients will get watered down and the taste won't be nearly as robust. We have a perfect recipe with just the right amount of sugar blend, one lemon, and a perfect amount of ice and water. To keep making your lemonade, fill the serving cup with water to the mark below the brim of the cup. Next, place the shaker lid securely over the top of the serving cup and make sure it's on tight. You can hear it click. And my last tip, use one hand to hold the top of the cup and the lid. I like to make a claw to keep the lid in place. And use your other hand at the base of the cup so that when you rotate, you prevent spills. Turn that cup upside down and shake vigorously. Always turn the cup upside down to shake so that the lemons and sugar spread throughout the entire drink. With any process, there are a few safety measures to keep in mind. Let's start with the sectionizer because it has a sharp blade. Always keep your hands away from the surface because the blade is just underneath and never try to push a lemon through with only your hands. If you need to clean the sectionizer, lift the handle to the highest position and lock the head in place by inserting the plastic pin at the back of the machine. To remove the plunger, you can use the knobs at the top of the machine. The blade cup can also be removed but only lift from the bottom and push the cup upward. I recommend using a plastic cup to pop the blade out. And when using the crusher, always be careful to put it on a steady surface. Be careful, it's heavy. Now, when you're using it and you're right-handed, it has suction cups on the bottom, so you could tilt it slightly for easier use if you're right-handed, or to the left if you're left-handed. But if there's more than one person using the machine, I recommend just keeping it centered. Now, when lifting it, always use the bottom and the back. Be careful of the moving parts. They're heavy. Both of these pieces of equipment 
are built to last through heavy business and are durable. Be careful with them and stay safe. And you'll be equipped to make any Bill's World Famous Lemonade.